You know, as we talk about optics, you know, we're not the only company that has optics, but we have something very unique about our optics. And, you know, part of what the patents talk about is this light on the angle. And really it creates, you know, we look silly when we're explaining to people, yeah, oh, it does this cross beaming. But what's cool is... It's there right, it is, there yeah, it is. there it is. Yeah, that's, that's, I mean, this facility is definitely one of the best examples of, yeah. of, of, of looking at that cross beaming. And it really brings it in. I mean, you can really see the point right here. And the reason we laid these lights out at the height that we did was because that's where they wanted their final canopy, right? So, well, they, you can see that there's, you know, people sometimes think, well, it's not gonna grow in between here, but you really only have about a six inch right. gap before these beams cross each other, Yeah, you know? And I mean, and that's, that's what we always see. And I, I get that question often is, you know, how are you guys getting such good coverage with these 120 degree lenses? And you can see those photons crossing right there. And half the time, this area here is where you're actually gonna get your high PPFD. Yep. Everybody just, is that old school lighting style, everybody's because looking here. Everybody else's LEDs, they, they're pinpoint hotspots straight down. Right. So like you said, if we had our meter here, it would be softest here yeah. and heaviest here, heavier because, here because you're getting both lights or multiple lights right. crossing each other. Yeah, and the exciting thing about the light coming through at the angle like that is leaves don't lay flat. They're always at an angle. So we're driving these photons further down into these plants where if this is your final canopy, you're still getting that cross beaming, nice high levels on the top there. Down into that canopy, you're still getting the photons, still getting the production. Well, and this is the geometry of light that nobody's talking about. Right. You know, we're you know we measure light like we measure architectural light, like in, in a building. Yeah. And you're measuring it on a flat surface, and that's how all the meters were designed as well too. Yep. But plants aren't flat surfaces. Right. And especially with how leaves grow, you need to inject like vectors of light at different angles, which is what these optics really do. Yeah, exactly. And you know, uh, this is another prime example of hitting these lights back into the plants as it comes off the edge, off this white surface, back into the plants. I mean, we gotta always remember that all these wavelengths of photons are gonna hit at different, you know, those reds are gonna pass through, the blues are gonna get into the, into through the leaf layers down further into the plants. So really important to have that cross beaming, have those high PPFD. Yeah, levels. cross beaming, different geometry and vectors of light. I mean, this is why these optics are growing so much deeper and penetrating like LEDs never have before. Exactly, and you can still get them nice and close to these fixtures, and because of that nice spread, you see that nice spread, instead of that straight down, you're not getting that bleaching, yeah. you're not getting that right. burning.